Well, it's uh, 345. All the vendors are set up. Come on, Gladys. What's the matter with you? Anyway, it got me in my normal spot, but it moved everybody up about five spots. I'm down here all by myself. Same place I always are. Just nobody for ways. This lady right here is my first customer with five knives. Two old Victor Knoxes. I mean, one big Victor Knox and some others. minutes about 20 minutes a Victor Knox and a Chinaman and then here we got a oh, not in there we got a global in there we got an old saboteur somewhere carbon steel whatever she might have already been gone she came and got it I mean we done so one two 16 blades, 112. 16 blades? I think you might be done. Nice. Yep. You are correct. Whew. The weather is uh, threatening. Yes, it does look a little bright. They call it for afternoon uh, shake up. A nice little flock of saboteurs. Look, I like them. Big shafts, a boner, and a little utility para. Saboteur, you can't beat them. Well, we got 40 minutes to go. And we're one short of what we were yesterday at the other farmer's market. Which is okay. I got most of my stuff put away because I'm afraid of the storm this afternoon. But I don't need any of it right now because it's bleak. The leader's gone hunting ice cream and popsicles. She was hot. It's hot today, I'm telling you. It's blazing hot. Not much breeze. Once in a while we get a little puff because you can see that feather sign. It's hardly moving. Market's pretty busy though. But this market's always been pretty busy. I mean, not jammed in here like they are on Saturday morning, but it's a different situation. This market is relatively new. That one's been there 10, 12 years. And it's every Saturday. This one's every other Thursday. The big old Bowser, Makita, Akita, or whatever you call him. Okay. Key lime. Look at that. Key lime by two. From the popsicle lady. Joy sickles, she calls them. Yeah, right there. Well, we made it home before the storm. It's looking damn rough, I can tell you. Big old Jack said, I'm glad you made it home so we can play some ball. Circus train dog. That's right. Circus train, that's right. Let's take a look at the figs. It's been a few days. I see no change in any of them. I don't understand that. They should be getting fatter and browner. But there's a lot of them. I just don't understand it. The garden is doing good. We got our first heirloom tomato off of there today. I had it for lunch. Tomatoes Gazoa. What are you doing over there, Indian? Come on. Indian. Indian likes this rope right here. 
That's her only thing. She don't play with the balls too much. Oh, shut up. You spoiled belly damn devil, you. That's right. Get that rope. Get it. <laughs> shut up. That one right under your leg, you didn't even see it. I got to catch it. That's right. I'll get back to you in a minute. I cut the grass and edged everything this morning before I went to the knife gig. Nice van over there, Mercedes. I had to be the knife shop in Mobile right there. Or a mini home. Everything's nice and edged. Looks, uh, like I said, a little same way out here was back there. The clouds seem to be moving to the north pretty good. That big fat one hanging around right there. But all the little ones are moving. I don't know what will happen. What will happen? Let's go see what the leader's getting ready to cook for supper. I could eat a gorilla. These are purple peppers, like green peppers and purple, red peppers. I thought they were onions. No, those are, those are peppers. Those are the onions. And Italian sausage. We got this at the market today from one of the vendors. Italian restaurant guy. Pomodoro. Pom yeah. Pomodoro sauce. Breathtaking. A nice little flock of savage ears. Look. I like them. Big shafts, a boner, and a little utility pair. Savage ear, you can't beat them. 